Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Infinity and welcome to Detroit. Before we get started, I'd like to recognize a birthday. 29 years ago, Infinity was born in the USA, right here at the Detroit Motor Show. The Infinity brand was launched with the promise to create a new relationship between the car and the driver. 51 Infinity dealerships were opened simultaneously across the US, and we launched the Q45. The Fresh Badge was created with two central lines leading off into an infinite point on the horizon, which symbolizes our desire to always look forward to new horizons, to infinity. And we've been innovating and doing things differently ever since. In those short 29 years, we've launched many world-first technologies to enhance performance, driving, and safety, with many more industry-leading innovations in the pipeline. Now, one of my favorite quotes about infinity is from our Nissan chairman, Mr. Carlos Ghosn. Infinity is not about doing what everyone else is doing. It's not about copying conservative notions of luxury. We will not try to be all things to all people, but everything to some people. And like many 29-year-olds, we're ambitious, and we enjoy being a challenger brand. Now, this mindset has been serving us well. Infinity is on a roll here in the Americas and globally. We're pleased to announce that in the US, we've sold over 153,000 vehicles in 2017, which is an 11% increase year over year. This marks the fifth consecutive record sales year for Infinity in the US and makes us one of the fastest growing luxury automotive brands. The recent launch of our latest Q50 Sport sedan has strengthened its position as our core model. And higher up on the portfolio, the new QX80 full-size SUV just went on sale here in the US. With its combination of power, sumptuous interior, advanced technologies, and utility, the new QX80 will be a big winner. Our success is due to our product offensive, the continued development of the Infinity brand, and our customer experience. And to tell you a little bit more about our global operations, it's my pleasure to introduce Division Vice President of Global Sales and Marketing, Christian Meunier. Thank you, Randy. Happy, happy New Year and happy birthday to Infinity. It truly is a great time to be with Infinity. And as Randy said, we're on a roll in the US and globally. Not only did we have record sales in the US, we also set a new global record in 2017. We sold more than 246,000 vehicles, an increase of 7%, with the majority of our sales in the US and in China. This is our eighth consecutive annual global sales record. The US is our biggest market, and China, our biggest growth market. We have very ambitious plan to grow our presence there. We expect 2018 to be even better as we launch our all-new QX50 crossover. The QX50 is the most important vehicle we have ever launched, ever and it embodies everything the brand stands for. Beautiful design, advanced technologies, amazing performance, empowering to drive. It is abso absolutely stunning inside and out. The QX50 embodies a design language we call powerful elegance. And as you can see, it has very distinctive proportions. It has the ideal combination of space and utility with a very premium interior that is driver-centric but passenger-minded. The QX50 features the world's first variable compression ratio engine, which we call VC Turbo. This is the first time ever in the history of the automobile that the production vehicle has an engine that can change its compression ratio on the fly and give the driver the best combination of power and efficiency when they need it. This is the perfect combination between a sprinter and a marathon runner. The power of a V6 and the efficiency of a four-cylinder. It does this by adjusting the height of the piston stroke depending on what the driver needs. It's truly a breakthrough technology. It's a perfect example of the ingenuity and entrepreneurial spirit of infinity. VC Turbo is the ideal Next step in powertrain technology. There is a clear trend towards electric electrification right now. In the meantime, there will be millions of internal combustion engines sold 
And this technology offers a great opportunity to significantly improve efficiency, fuel consumption, and emission during the transitional phase. In short, VC Turbo is the perfect bridge to the path, on the path to electrification. The QX50 also features the company's latest semi-autonomous driving technology, ProPilot Assist. It is intuitive, it supports the driver, and it keeps the occupant safe. ProPilot Assist is the next step towards full autonomy. It's a huge advantage for stop and go in traffic and for a long journey. The QX50 arrives at the perfect time for Infinity. The mid-size crossover segment is one of the fastest growing segments in the world. Here in the US and Canada, in China, our biggest growth market, as well as Europe and the Middle East. It represents between 20% and 35% of the premium market. Consider this. In the past five years, this segment has doubled in the US and tripled in China. We expect that the QX50 will be one of our most popular vehicles accelerating our sales momentum. It's the right car at the right time with the right technology. We're proud to be the luxury brand of the Renault Nissan Mitsubishi Alliance, which sold more than 10.5 million vehicles last year. With that kind of scale, Infinity can offer the most advanced technologies more efficiently around the world. And you will see many of them first in our showrooms. With that in mind, it gives me great pleasure to introduce a new design language for Infinity that points the way to a very exciting future. Ladies and gentlemen, the Infinity Q Inspiration concept. Please welcome on stage Senior Vice President Global Design, Nissan Motor Company, Alfonso Albaisa. Thank you, Tomas. Ladies and gentlemen, the Infinity Q Inspiration. Infinity, like the auto industry, is at an inflection point, and it's a very exciting time for us as designers. As our next generation of technologies start to take shape, Q Inspiration heralds a new generation for Infinity. This seamless and stunning new design philosophy shows Infinity artistry in the age of autonomy, connectivity, and breakthrough powertrains. In case of the Q Inspiration, 
as these technologies started to become visible, our team created a little project called the Prototype 9. You would think, during, you would think de designing a heritage car would not be an inspiration for a concept with this kind of advanced technology. But actually, Prototype 9 became a kind of blank canvas for us to play with. This allowed new discoveries and new expression for our design teams globally, who found beauty and artistry in as few brushstrokes as possible. Additionally, Prototype 9 reconnected us to the Japanese concept of ma, the concept which seeks the mastery of the empty space, to be able to design something so strong that it can live in a very open environment. The simplest and most clear, also we, we sought inspiration in uh, another definition of elegance, which is the simplest and most clever solution to a s complex set of equations. Well, let's take a look as I walk you around the car. So as I mentioned, the, advanced, the new technologies is causing in infinity to take a look at proportions. 29 years ago here, we showed the Q45 for the first time. And this was a V8 for a Japanese brand. It was a completely unusual. And it set this large hood and cabin rearward proportion of all infinities, including the FX, which is the QX70, and of course, the very sexy Q60 Coupe. But as our powertrains start to reduce, it allowed us to shift the cabin forward to give you a new kind of sexiness. How did we do that? So yes, the A-pillar has moved back, but it also has brought us to the front end, which we show performance not in the traditional way. We've removed a lot of the chrome, and one of the most clever parts of this grill, for instance, is in front view, you can see the fins, but as soon as you move to the side, it becomes invisible. So the expression is not only of an internal combustion engine, but it is also of an advanced technology powertrain that doesn't need to breathe so much. Additionally, the teams, instead of focusing on just the headlamp having a signature, our grille itself is defining the front of the car in a very unique and edge lighting kind of way. The headlamps. The headlamps now are hiding the LED source in the body and using advanced reflective technologies to give this very deep and interesting view. Walking around the side, here is where Infinity Artistry has taken a new look. So if you can imagine, in the rear, there is a sense of a spine that comes around the back, disappears into the fender, comes out through the body, disappears again to the front. This kind of simple idea that results in this amazing nuanced sculpture is one of the key things about the Infinity Q inspiration. Now, cabin is centered, cabin is flowing, you're moving back with the car. This is another part of the expression of performance in our brand. The cabin tapers around, the lights are very thin and wide using the same reflective technologies of the front, but now those rear fenders are out very far showing a truly performance new type of sedan. So, as you see, the glass roof also brings your eye to the back and you can actually invite you to look in at the very interesting interior, which I will show you now. Here again, the technology is, was freeing up our designers. As you can see, the floor is quite flat. The center console is floating because not only that we are steer by wire, we're shift by wire, which is freeing up all the mechanical components and sending them into another place. Also, Infinity is about a new type of technology. So not only can you feel the fingerprint of the artist in all of the, the leather work, but also you're seeing this seamless connectivity to all the things you need and value in your life. So as you can see here, the A-pillar to A-pillar uh, meter actually ducks under the wood, and it gives you this seamless floating uh, wood and technology expression, which we think is quite modern, and it's the new infinity driver-oriented uh, condition. So hopefully a little later, you can come in, and you can sit and see all the great craftsmanship, including the wood with the back lighting, which is very impressive. So. The Q Inspiration has been liberating for the design team. And I want to thank, you, thank them for the wonderful job. And also, I'd like to recognize Karim Habib, our executive design director for Infinity, 
who will be guiding us into the future with all of the new creations, which I can't wait to see, maybe next week. And uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> this is the first manifestation of Infinity's new form language for an era, an era of advanced powertrains and future technologies. I was here in 1989 when Infinity was born. And with this Q inspiration, you can see just how far we have come. And I hope you like this as much as we like designing it. So please come, take a look. Don't touch, but take a look. And uh, we'll be here to answer any questions. <laughs>